my god! I had a friend who used to say to me, the show is happening when the show is not happening. People have wanted, like, me to be back on Housewives, but a lot of times they're like, get that other shit out of the way, we just want to see what you're getting into. And the producers used to say, we love watching you make a sandwich, like organizing the closet, anything. So this is the show behind the show. And the reason I always say that the show is happening when the cameras aren't on is that magical, majestic, crazy shit happens to me you wouldn't believe. Luggage is a problem for me. Like, I love luggage, and I've tried to get to a place with luggage. I've had Louis Vuitton luggage. I want it to be like a rich bitch luggage person. I've been this jerk. I've had Louis Vuitton luggage and the carry-on, and it doesn't expand. It's not big enough. You're just looking for someone to take it. Not practical. Bought that on like a resale site. Nothing fits in it. People are gonna wanna rob you. It doesn't expand. It's for losers. I'm a loser because I kept one piece, but whatever. That's for like, go to Chinatown and buy a fake bag for one day and then you'll see. So that's Louis Vuitton. Then you get to Toomey. I had the Toomey like big, like it was, it was heavy and I wanted to like be cute. So then I start, what, bought the Ramoa which was very fancy and very elite and very expensive and had a red handle and I was feeling myself and I thought I'm gonna be this person because I had seen this very hot couple in the airport in St. Barts that had like a Goyard suitcase and a, and a Ramoa, like a Goyard carry-on. So I got the Ramoa. That's full bullshit. The lining comes out, it doesn't expand immediately now. How could I really review this luggage unless I travel with it? And it's becoming an expensive venture but doing the Lord's work. I'm so pissed as you could probably imagine. So let's glue this back together now. So then I started reviewing luggage and it became a thing. And I'm still not at the end. So now companies have started to send me luggage. That's the process we're in now. This was sent by Briggs and Riley. I think we should call Danielle now. So Briggs and Riley sent this stuff? Yes. Well, it's not a complete family. I can't do this. Like I need to see the whole family together to make an assessment. Cause okay. there's a Navy medium and like, this is the, this is what got me into this. This Navy medium got me into this whole mess because I had like pieces, parts, chicken pieces, parts, and I wanted one whole family. And now I don't have that. At the very least, every family member needs to have a small expandable. Like I could do a medium and a small cause that's like for a three to five day trip. And I could do an expandable and a large cause that's like for a seven to nine day trip. But what I cannot do is like one medium. It goes with nothing and I'll, it'll give me anxiety. It's actually lovely. They want to show me their trunk because we talked about the trunk from Toomey. Toomey is the mother of all luggage brands. I've had this very heavy hound's tooth and I'd like to see the inside. So that they have probably a reason and it's very lightweight. A lot of people said this and Toomey were the like amazing. So this is a more lightweight version. It's amazing. I cannot make an assessment until I have a whole family together. Okay. Luggage I knew was, like getting into luggage I knew was gonna be a different story. How could I do a review without a, a, a small expandable? Like the, 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 the key to the family, it's the land of broken toys. <laughs> the key to the family is the expandable mini. No one gets it. No, Anybody could do a big suitcase. Doing an expandable mini, that is the heart of the household. Let me just tell you all the boxes you have to check. You need an extra large, something for a very long trip, possibly international. A large thing that's like a good five day trip guy. A small, it should be expandable. You need a lock, the wheels to roll well, reasonably lightweight, durable, and you need it to look cute. They have an international carry on and they have a domestic, a continental carry-on. I didn't know that the international carry-on is smaller. I thought international carry-on should be bigger. bigger right. But I guess for most planes, the overhead space in international it's is smaller. smaller. I did not know that. I've learned a lot, yeah. but I've gotten nowhere. <sighs> yeah, this needs a small. Yeah. Tell Dan, I don't want too much coming here. Well, no, well, whatever they send, they send. We'll get rid of it and we'll send it to the Hamptons and we'll give more luggage away. Like I really wanted to wear a sweat like a cardigan today. But I know. Vicky said no. Vicky said no. She said it's too hot. I can't do it. All right. I'm gonna panic. I want to go home. Let's just get organized. Okay, we're going. We're going in here. Oh my God, you're not wrong. Because there also should be laid down. Everybody doesn't need to stand up. This this guy. Okay. It just needs to be, you guys are being dramatic. There's so much, there's so much room. There's the whole thing down there. You guys just, there's another door in my other closet too. This is a crawl space that goes down behind my closet, the whole house. 
and we like made it nice. We put flooring in, like we like it back here. This is a place that we spent a lot of time. I just don't think the space is being used properly. But this is amazing. This is being, everyone's being dramatic. We have more than enough room for as much luggage as we want. We're totally great. I'm not gonna take more luggage for like, but this is amazing. Look how organized this is. These are the boot stuffers. These are all our garment bags. This is all the luggage. It all has like nice wrapping. It's great. The crawl space is gorgeous. You guys are being overly dramatic. There's tons of room. Oh my God. I don't know anything. <sighs> A woman's work is never done. Well, these are on deck. So these are just right in the front. They, they're in purgatory. They're in luggage purgatory and they don't know what they're doing. But I feel very happy. They're, they're all really taken care of and it's nice. No, this isn't a bad place to live. Not at all. Place. I would absolutely. The Louis Vuitton is going to the Hamptons. It's okay. a fact. That's an absolute fact. Okay. So this is great. This is, listen. And this is my favorite thing I've ever owned in my entire life. I'm a little jealous. Who fought me on this? Somebody fought Laney? Laney. I did a review on this yesterday. One of my favorite finds on TikTok. It's the greatest thing ever. It's genius because I'm doing a birthday party for Bryn. So all the goodie bags come with this. It's good for like Christmas presents or just lugging shit. It's unbelievable. I'm obsessed with this. It's an immediately yes. It makes me so happy. This is a great company. You could like log luggage with that thing. It's amazing. Okay. Bye. I travel a great deal and I'm an expert on pa packing cubes. I, I got locked. This is what a compression cube is. Everybody says that they have compression cubes and it's a scam. It's just a bag, like a limp, loose bag. This is a compression cube. It compresses your stuff and it expands. Luggage is something that if I'm struggling with as an expert on travel, what must Americans be doing? And I found that I'm right. They're all trying to get to Mecca of luggage and they can't because it's either too expensive and too fancy and then it's nice and it doesn't it doesn't expand, it's not functional, or it's too nice and it dings, or it's like hyped up like Ramoa for $3,000 and you think, okay, I spent the money, it's gonna be great, and it's not even great. So I don't have one set of luggage that I love. So I keep trying, and then once I started reviewing it, I can't not finish something. So I started reviewing it, and the people want me to finish, and I haven't finished, and it has to be a complete set, so it keeps coming, and I just want, I want to close out the tab. I'm not, I'm not even kidding, I'm actually being serious. It ha I'm not like finding it that funny anymore. It has to be closed out. It's also hard when everyone you work with knows how it's seen you are. That's challenging too. I realized that I thought like I wanted to be semi-retired and I was kind of didn't have anything to do. I don't really work out. So like there was nothing to do, like fiddle around the house. Can we have a meeting? Why I'm so needy. Why are you so needy? Yeah, why am I still like needed so much? Oh, I'm needy. I don't think, come here because I want to show you something. And I need okay. your, okay. So did you notice anything different in here? The windows. Okay, so let's understand something. So before the windows were like that with panes. I still have them in the basement. We can still have them. We have growing panes. So now it's open and you can really see more of the backyard. And I'm gonna, we're gonna paint the frames black. So it's going to still tie in the kitchen. The thing is, if you keep the old window panes, it's more old fashioned and more country house, but you don't get to see the outside. So when you're inside here, like I like, my goal was to feel like I was outside versus feeling like you have the black fence back there, which interferes with the panes. So I just want to know what your honest opinion is. Do you go for open or do you go for panes? Okay. You go for open? Yay! And you want to look outside and whistle while you work. Yeah, and that's pain in the neck to clean. It's it's a pain in the say it. It's a pain in the neck. Right, P A N E in the neck. <laughs> Thank you for saying what I wanted you to say. I'm not. I don't lunch as a verb. I, I didn't have anything to do, so this became like a, a hobby, a stupid hobby. And anything I do, I do well. So I did this weird thing. I just have to corral it and get organized and not let it take me over, which is fine. And luggage was stupid, but I would like to finally myself find one thing of luggage and I think I, I have a couple of good options for myself and then I'll be done. It's fun to make something you're doing into content. It's just like a hobby. It's weird, I enjoy it a lot. And it's fun to do with Paul too. Both of us, we're homebodies. So it can be like, sometimes life can be boring. We're very happy, but we, we sometimes are like, 
let's go to CVS and like f around. And we like, we'll just literally laugh at CVS. That feels expensive to me. What are you laughing at, Paul, without me? <laughs> That's been a thing we've always done. Oh my God. The family came for the blue luggage. Now the family's at the house. The family's never together. The family's never together. <laughs> luggage needs to be a full family. So today I don't I don't feel safe because we don't have a full family in the house of the luggage that just came that I've been complaining about. So I said let's give away some luggage. So we put the luggage in the car to give away. And the family the rest of the the adopted children, the rest of the family just came. So they're at the house. So now everybody's so so now they're separated. So thank God I didn't give away this because then I would have half a family at home. We had half You can't write this shit. There's no way. Let's call Vicky. Hi. Hi, Vicky. Hi. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm really lovely. I really appreciate oh appreciate you and your contribution at all times. Oh, I appreciate you too. Thank you, Vicky, so much. Um, this is when we do passive aggressive talk because they know that the lunatic has escaped the loony bin. You sent a text to me and I'm wondering what that's referring to. Well, you know, just some extra luggage. We think we don't have enough, so we just need a few more. You needed a few more pieces? Well, yeah, let me ask you a question. Does the luggage match anything else? Is it more stray family members or does it match these family members? Yeah, no, they match. They are actually part of the family now. And the small one is blue? Yes. We'll have a luggage meeting later. Okay, I love you, Vicky. Thank you so much. You have a great day. You have a wonderful day. They talk down to me. Wow! It's a major bag alert. You, this? I want to know what it is. I want to know how to get involved. This company we could talk to and make them make the drink, yeah. the drink holder. Right. The other one has a pop out drink holder. Your sunglasses, your cell phone, your dreams, a water bottle, your hopes. Like this is this is this is this is this is a gorgeous family, and I'm happy I didn't give this away. This is really nice, and we can nest it. That's getting a mother review. That's a pop. That's a luggage. Vicky, you like it? I love it. You, oh my, you love, love She that. said that when she opened it. She was like, I love this one. This makes me feel real. That's I'm a luggage influencer. And not many people could say that. I'm a luggage influencer. <laughs> That's, and we can nest. It's a nester. This is AMA, ask me anything. Drop a comment, ask me a question. With any luck, you'll get an answer. Ask me anything.